Hello, how are you doing today? These are the two kendamas I bought yesterday. Um, these are called the Ketchy Air Kendama. And I saw them on our website uh, where me and Nikki originally wanted to buy them. Uh, there's three models, so I got these two, there's a third one I didn't get, but they're really nice. I'd like to get the last one eventually later on. But when I looked at the website where to get these at catchykendama.com, uh, the shipping was more expensive than the actual Kendama. Um, but we found them in Copenhagen, we're really happy, so I'm gonna open one of these bad boys and we'll see um, what they're like. Um, I need to find out where to open this the easiest. Because um, these are like really, really funny wrapped. Um, I think I'll have to ruin the packaging. So, let's get into it. Alrighty, um, <laughs> these are a bit more hard to open than I thought they would be. Alright, let's get into this. So packaging is definitely not able to be saved. So let's get this out. Here it is. The first classic condemner. And um, have a look here. It has like rubber in here so it should help land and stuff. And the ball feels Fairly good actually. I gotta say, this is a weird kendama for me. <laughs> the sound is really funny. The nice gray one, let's open the other one while, while we're at it. I can do the same, maybe. Get into it. <laughs> They're very hard to open. Open, I'm going out. Maybe I should use a scissor, but I don't got one. Oh, there we go. And this is the red one. Yeah. Which one are you favorite? The last one has um, a green ball and blue handle, I think it is. Or maybe it's the other way around. I'll be using this one here. Which is the gray and turquoise. Or This is weird. The sound is strange. They play well. It's just like a normal wooden canal, but it's really, really different. So that's funny. How is the um, lighthouses? <laughs> that's what you do. How about the windows? The window balance is good in it? Yep. Those are fine. Jumping sticks. <laughs> it's a fun cool thing down, I gotta say. Cool addition and the fun thing is also that you can like see through the whole thing. Which is so funny. Especially with the ball as well, you can see like that there. You can look all the way through. So yeah. So I decided to walk up towards uh, Casper to pick up my scooter and I wanna stop in by Nick on the way to hand in a computer for his neighbour. And this happened. Yay, piss him down. And it doesn't look like it's gonna stop anytime soon. I got dirty limbs, but yeah. Rain and grey, so I will probably get extremely wet walking back home. Which sucks. I miss our car not fully working. Or well, I wish our car working. So I could at least have got my scooter into home and done. I need to clean it again because Casper spilled coal all over it and uh, got a little bit dirty, so I had to like clean the whole thing. I'll do that when I come home. A lazy Tuesday here, wet Tuesday. Uh, not very nice. So back home again, and I've just been taking my scooter completely apart and washing the deck because it got like soda on it. Casper had uh, a Coke that he accidentally spilt uh, down on my deck. So I just washed uh, all the stuff. And you can actually wash grip tape if you just use it very gently uh, and if you've got a good quality grip tape. I had no problems. I washed my grip tape several times just with using a brush and getting the stuff off which is cool yeah um, I've been watching a little bit of paranormal adventures or ghost adventures today I like that show um, I think that's like interesting so that's how I've been spending my day on it's been raining outside quite a lot 
Um, just been laughing a little bit and seeing some reactions with the shotgun pens, but I found out the ones I have are not the authentic one. Uh, the authentic one I used to have is that when you press the button, you would hear a, little, a noise. You can hear a zzz noise, uh, and you can actually change the battery in it. This one here you can't. So these here are cheaper versions, um, and they don't give as much shock. Uh, yesterday I um, shot myself quite a few times and I couldn't actually hold it down, not this one here, this is a brand new one. The other one I had a, I left in the chrome store for the guys to prank the friends. Um, but tomorrow <laughs> I will in the skate park bring this because all the kids are like signing in and setting a little mark whenever they arrive to skate park. So I'm going to bring this out there and trying to get as many of them as possible. And just to prove you guys that um, I would not shock anyone without having done it myself. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and do it now. This pen here is nowhere near as bad as the first one I had. The first one I had was really, really bad. I want to get one of those again, but these ones here are like not too bad. But I'm going to try and do it now here. And you can see how much it basically needs to go down. If you look here. Like that. So I'm going to do that. And uh, I'll probably get, ow, um, because I don't like sharks. I hate sharks. Um, I'm going to do it. So I'm going to show you. I'm pressing it down. Are you ready? <laughs> I did this so many times yesterday, but I still hate it. That's so stupid. And also because this is brand new, I don't know how strong the batteries are. So, all right, let's go ahead and do it. Three, two, one. No. <laughs> I'm such a scared chicken shit. All right, screw it. Okay, let's go ahead and do it. Why can I be so scared? I did it yesterday. <laughs> I'm such a chicken shit. Screw it. I'm a man. I can do this. Ah. Ah, that's not that bad. Just need to get used to it. Okay, now I can hold it already. There we go. I'm holding it. <laughs> I can't get any further down. So, <laughs> it tingles, but it's not that bad, so. Um, so yeah, <laughs> I, I was nervous that this might be a lot more powerful because it was brand new. So now you've seen I've done it. <laughs> and it's not bad, because I hate sharks. And the old one I had, I I could feel the pain for a long time. This here, I can do it, see? It's not. It's, it's, it's just a little buzz, uh, it feels funny. So I'm going to be using this some more and pranking the kids. I'm probably going to bring some of them out in skate parking house because some of the kids want to buy them uh, to prank the friends with because these are not very powerful. So anyways, <laughs> oh, and uh, I painted my bar some more because um, I noticed there were some places I forgot to paint. So I had to roll the handles up. So now it's like all proper black again, nice and shiny. Um, but it looks awesome when it's all put together. I had to clean my whole scooter so, oh shit. Make a lot of noise. So uh, I'm just leaving that for drive to tomorrow and I'll see you guys. So yeah, stay awesome and epic. And if you want to get one of these shotgun pens, keep an eye out because I'm going to do a giveaway. Um, maybe two other pens I'm going to use for my my last giveaway, which is like 500 people ago, which is crazy because you guys are awesome. Keep subscribing. <laughs> I can't believe I was such a shaky ching shit about it. Can I do it again? Yeah, I can do it. Not bad. Oh. oh, it's not that bad in there. What? So I can, oh, I can do it like that. But if you do it in the thumb, it's like a lot more. So yeah, I don't know tomorrow's kid says, Well, there's nothing wrong with this pen. <laughs> I can do it. <laughs> so yeah, alright. I'll, uh, I'll catch you guys tomorrow. Stay awesome and happy. See you guys. Well, you want to do a whip over that scary corner there? Be careful, bro. <laughs> it's scary, isn't it? We're not used to that Steve Rams. <laughs>